there were plenty of magic moments in the Bundesliga in October. <laughs> Is this a last chance? They cross from Anderson and the goal! We take a look back. Enjoy. Well, this is a very ambitious effort, but he's showing great balance and skill so far. Can he stay cool under pressure? And now some help for the man of the match day. An excellent piece of teamwork, a really dynamic duo. It would have been so easy to make a mistake and let something slip. And now the celebrations and enjoyments can really begin. There were also comical moments in Bundesliga 2. Oh, and the ball has been kicked against Lee. And Lucas Hinterseyer will score one of the easiest and most bizarre goals of his career. Remarkable! And he definitely stepped into it. He knew what he was doing. And then Hinterseyer could just race through. One of the most bizarre goals we'll see in Bundesliga 2 this season. Go Kimmy, go Kimmy. Oh. The Crazy Glasses Challenge. What a oh. contest. All the Bundesliga clubs took part, only one could prevail, and it was Augsburg. They were good. Congratulations to the winners of the Crazy Glasses Challenge. Marcel Rissa, fair play hero. An act of outstanding sportsmanship from the Köln forward lit up his sides meeting with Heidenheim. Marcel Rissa. Give and go, and Marcel Rissa is clipped on the edge of the penalty area by Norman Toyakal. And he's shown a yellow card as well for the Heidenheim player. He says he didn't touch his man, and now Rissa is in conversation with the referee to be a Spieler. I think he's telling him that this isn't a free kick. Rissa was just trying to avoid a potential challenge there. The yellow card's taken away. And with Köln 1-0 down, this is an extraordinary gesture from Rissa. It isn't a free kick either. Jaden Sancho and Rhys Nelson. The English duo of this season's young guns. Sancho already has four goals and six assists to his name. Nelson also has four goals and an assist. And the goal! Finally, Martini is beaten! And would you believe that? It's Reese Nelson yet again! My goodness! Dahoud releases Mario Goetze. It's Mario Goetze arriving far post, angle tight. It matters not for Jaden Sancho. His third league goal, a burgeoning season. A rapid fire counter. And then, doesn't Sancho finish well? Jaden Sancho at the moment is unplayable. Keep it up, guys. In fifth place is Leipzig's six goal spectacle against Nuremberg. Timo Ferner. Options arriving in the middle. One of them is Campbell. On a landmark game for Kevin Campbell. Werner breaks to Palsen 2 0. Just too open, Nuremberg. Allowing Leipzig through again. Savitzer, oh, that's in at the near post. And then Forsberg again. Forsberg back from injury. His efforts blocked. And Timo Werner has just scored his 50th Bundesliga goal. Savitzer sweeps it towards goal, and that one's in two. He has a second. Alton, Valentini again beaten. Still Palsen. And Werner for 6-0. It is a gift. 
This is RB Leipzig's biggest ever Bundesliga victory. Lots to ponder for Nuremberg, but in the first top flight meeting of these two sides, the hosts win it 6 0. The man who spearheaded Dortmund's success, Marco Reus! He's the inaugural recipient of the Bundesliga's Player of the Month awards. And Marco Reus scores! Marco Reus to wrap it up! First off, I'd like to say thanks very much. I'm delighted. It's a nice trophy and a real honour to be the first player to win it. Oh, sweet! So very sweet! There was yet another historic moment in Bundesliga 2. Right fourth minute in this exciting game. Udiona trailing at home by one goal to nil. The goalkeeper's up front as well. Is this a last chance? They cross from Anderson and the goal! The goalkeeper has scored at the death. Rafael Gikovic found that space. And after the cross from Anderson, he gets the better of Strauss and scores with his head. Lovely flick on two from Friedrich. And the equaliser scored by goalkeeper, superhero Rafael Gikovic. It's 1-1. They're still undefeated. Not many people will forget this match. The Alcacer show against Augsburg. Here comes the cavalry. Marco Alcacer. Can he play the role of super sub again? James Sancho on the move. And here's the chance. And here's the goal. Paco Alcacer playing the role of super sub yet again. Free kick taken quickly. Alcacer! Once again, Dortmund's saviour. Paco Alcacer is loving life in the Bundesliga. And it's 2 2. Very last chance, surely, in the sixth minute of stoppage time. It's Alcacer going for goal! I don't believe this! With surely the last kick of the game, Paco Alcacer completes his hat trick. Borussia Dortmund with another extraordinary comeback. 4 3. A clear number one is Frankfurt's Luka Jovic. What a display from the Serbian. Kostic and Jovic! It's a goal to get the pulse racing. The kind of goal that players dream of scoring. Luka Jovic, instincts and supreme technique. Here's Kucinovic and Alain and Jovic! This is scintillating, spellbinding football from Eintracht Frankfurt. And for the first time in his Bundesliga career, Luka Jovic scores multiple goals in one league game. Filip Kostic, and now Jovic! Hat-trick! It's been a truly extraordinary night for Luka Jovic. And it's four for Jovic! His night just keeps getting better and better and better. And it's in towards Jovic! It's one of the greatest individual displays in Bundesliga history. A moment for Frankfurt fans to say, I was there. At 20, Jovic, the youngest player, to score five times in a Bundesliga game. The first to do it for Frankfurt. What was your favourite moment? Let us know in the comments. Hi guys. Did you like that? Subscribe here. <laughs> Don't miss any of the Bundesliga action. Subscribe now.